Uh, welcome to uh, should a basement be on level zero or level one? I I maintain that uh, basement should be like a walkout basement should be on level one. I think a lot of people do it on level zero, and I think uh, I, I obviously it works very well for them. But I I'll show you why it doesn't work for me. Here's a house right here, and I had that main house right here, the top floor on level one, and I had the basement on level zero. I did I automatically built my foundation. And I have a basement. If I look at it in floor plan view right here, here it is right here. Now, um, I've, I've got a, uh, this is the default set. This is out of the box stuff. This is in my own uh, layer sets and stuff. But if I go to my um, uh, foundation, foundation DSH, it looks pretty good, I think, except I'm missing that slab right there, aren't I? Why am I missing that slab? If I come over to here and I go SLAB, SLAB, I think I'm going to possibly lose my, yep. I lost my slab on my garage right here. So obviously I want my slabs on. So why don't I have the edge of my slab right here for this basement? Well, that's because if I come back here to this right here, uh, uh, default set where, God, I can't even read this stuff anymore. <sighs> default set. I've got it on there. And, and if you're building a walkout basement, you're going to have a retaining wall and stuff, right? And, you, and that's fine. You can see all that stuff. And I think that stuff's put in place before the slab is. And so that, that makes sense. And so what layer is that thing on? Uh, no. What layer is that thing on? That thing is on layer walls foundation. Makes sense. Well, this one I actually put on layer walls normal because uh, it's a wood frame wall, and the slab has to be poured before the wall gets on there. So if I go to my de uh, my foundation layer set, the wall goes off, but I lose I lose my wall. And of course, you can draw a CAD line to represent the edge of the concrete, but uh, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Now it works, so that's that's one reason why. That's one re reason why. If I cut a section through there, that's that's what it looks like. Now. Here is something that's sort of interesting. Here's another reason why. If I have the garage that's on a slab, a, a pure slab, well, check out the check out this wall here. I mean, this wall. Let me see if I can do something here. Um, uh, default set, and make this make this you make this. I think I need to make this foundation. So, yeah, see. I don't know. If I do a slab foot footing, is that does that make, fix it? And, and now the slab's not really where I want it to be. I don't think. I, I guess maybe it does work. I don't know. Uh, hang on. If I change this back to not a slab footing, what happens? Uh, oh, isn't that weird? No, I mean it, not, not a slab. Okay, now I want it to have a footing. Specify footing. Specify footing. 16 by 24. Wow, a second ago, remember a second ago that, that wood went down there further, four inches down? I didn't, you know, it, it, I don't know. It didn't make sense to me. So over here, this is what I did on this. Now, this is sort of uh, interesting here in that um, if I go to uh, the garage, it's on a mono slab. It's on level zero, and this is the this sort of works. But um, let me make this door smaller so I can do something else. Now, if I if I if I automatically detail, I've got my stem wall right there, right? I got a curb. I have a curb, and if I go to my and I can see my footings right here. You see that footing right there for this wall? I see the footing there. I don't see a footing for this one because I didn't give it a footing, right? And that, that makes sense. Okay, I'll give it a footing. Specify foundation. Well, what size is it? 12, 16. There. Now I can now I can auto detail and I'll get my footing there. I mean that, that that's what you want to do. But here's the problem with that. Now if I go to my foundation set again. Oh, I know. I don't see my curb. Right? You don't see the curb right here. And and so how do you how do you see I don't I don't get this stuff man I just don't get it I just don't get it 
Four is at nine. That's right. The rough ceiling's at. Uh, I, I don't want to. I don't want a roof and a ceiling over that thing. I. I don't know what I just did. Oh, I, I, it, it, uh, it, it. I got the automatically build um, roof on there, so that's it's automatically building the roof like that. But I have a curb. I still have my curb, but I don't see the curb in plan view. That's the problem. And why don't I see the curb in plan view? Because if I go back to my default set, what I did right here to make my curb U is I made it a wall type. I made it a pony wall. So let's get rid of the pony wall and do this. And now let's do this U and uh, put a roof and ceiling over it, just you know because. See, I don't have the curb. I can't get the curb. I have to use a pony wall to get the curb. And it doesn't autom automatically detail. I don't know. It's delete it. Uh, it um, automatically detail. Uh, it sticks out a little bit because I guess it's, the, I guess it's out to the uh, sheathing and stuff right there. Isn't that weird? Now, over, over here, it's not because it's a curb. That's a curb right there. I mean, if I get rid of that curb, get rid of this, get rid of this. Get, I'm just getting rid of this. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of this. And, and so that's the main thing, uh, I think, is... is I don't want to belabor this. It works for some people. It just doesn't work for me. And uh, it just doesn't. But that's the reason why. I, I don't know if that was clear or not. So that's the reason, that's the main reason why um, I think that the, um, that the walkout basement needs to be on level one and the foundation for the walkout basement needs to be on level zero. Now that, that creates a few other little issues and I've done videos on that. But that's the gist of it. That's the gist of it. Uh, you, you can't get your curb, your concrete curbs, because the concrete curb comes from the wall of the sl slab, the stem wall of the slab, of the footing slab. And so you can't get your, think about it, that, that's why, I just I just really kind of just proved it again to myself that I, I don't either, I don't know what I'm doing or, or I'm correct in that uh, the walkout basement, there's more advantages to having the walkout basement on level one versus on level zero. That's the end.